bum 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 I'm gonna honestly have uh, Principality and Jack Frost do Mahamas. To hopefully kill the Incubus. As long as he doesn't resist uh, Mahama. Yeah, they're, they're level 22. They should die from the Mahamas. I love how Jack Frost says magic. Man, I love Jack Frost. I adore him. Alright, peace out, loser. This might not kill you, but if, it does, if this doesn't kill you, then Amino Uzume will. That's yeah, over. Get him, Amano Uzume. Love it. Gotta love it. Okay, thank you, Tayo. Get these Kelpie, why not? I want to see if we can get higher levels, because apparently, I'm underleveled. Oh, you're a uh, Sentada, right? See if we can get you on the team, actually. Are you weak to wind? Sakanagi. Goodbye. Bum, 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 bum. Pass. Let's chat. I have to look how long that other stream was. Demon is approaching. What will you do? Mm. Stop them. So, you won't allow me to close the distance so easily? I see, very wise. I'll have to look into you a bit more. Allow me to ask you something? Does it pain you to kill demons? No. Hey. Then allow me to change the question. Would it pain you to kill me? Pain you to kill me. Yes. <laughs> well, it wouldn't pain me to kill you. Alright, I failed that. Right. Oh my goodness. If that crit and Dohaleen died, I would have been so mad. Why did 35? When did the level jump get so high? I hate that. The level jump just immediately was like, yeah, we're, we're gonna like raise our levels like a, a notch. I hate that. I don't want to use my heart on my own and hope you resist it. I don't know. I'm not sure if you're weak to it or you resist it. I'm going to go for it. Alright, perfect. That was a good call. Now, I just have to hope you don't resist light. I could pass your turn and do Dohalim. What are Sentada's weaknesses? I don't want to risk a game over here. That attack really, like, scared me, and I don't want to get a game over because of it. Will he get hit by ice? I actually want to know before I do it. Yo, Raptor, what's up? Welcome to the stream. I'm actually, chat, I'm actually going to look. I'm doing something I rarely do. I do not want to find, I do not want to lose this. I'm going to look up. Sentada's affinities. Where'd you find Sentada? Uh, he's near the... He's he's after... Raptor, I don't know how far you are in the game. Did you fight a boss in uh, Shinagawa? I don't want to spoil in case I'm farther than you, but did you fight uh, Fion Makulan? He's after him. He's in the Conan second block. Electric? He's weak to electric? Alright. So in that case, we're going to ruin his thunder. You already fought Lamu again? Oh, you passed him then. I didn't fight Lamu again, but I'm assuming you're farther than me. Alright, that got dicey. Also, thank you for telling me, uh... Thank you for telling me about lightning. I mean, if he didn't resist ice, I was going to hit him with a Jack Bafula, but I didn't want to risk it being like, oh, he blocks ice, and then I get a game over. Uh, let's give our, let's give our strength a, actually, you know what? Let's give agility a boost. Catch that up a bit. Auto heal. So yeah, we did just do the, uh, Fionn Kalam fight. It wasn't like super, super hard. It wasn't easy though. It went pretty okay though. Wasn't super hard, wasn't super easy. 
was a challenge, but it wasn't annoying, so that's good. Didn't need to prep as much as as uh, compared to Nua. All I had to do, the problem was the Mirage on. All I had to do was use a fire dampener when the Mirage on came out and everything else went smoothly. But hey, that's not bad. Like, I'm not trying to say all oh, the fight was kind of easy. No, it was it was hard. Just didn't need to prep as much as the other two bosses. All we need to do is buy a fire dampener and that really just solved all our problems, honestly. And literally figuring out when to guard because of his other moves. Good fight, though. Who, who did I run into? Kelpie and two Nagas. Do I have Naga on the Compendium? I do not. I should probably try and do that. You still have to get, um, Huapo, too. I, I did say I would do that. As Block Thunder. Mm. Well. Just burn you. So we are at the point of the story, we're looking for the fairy village, basically. That is where I am in the story right now. The last thing we did was fight, um, Fionn Makalan. I think I'm saying his name right. I heard him pronounce it and I still forgot how you're supposed to say it. Right, these guys are 27, I shouldn't be a little, I shouldn't be that nervous. The Sentada was 35 though. I feel like the level jump's getting a little on the... Uh, oh my goodness, not Heat Wave. Heat Wave is scary because it can crit. Good counter. But, um... The levels are getting a little, uh... A little high. Not Naga, necessarily, but Sentada and the Baphomet were level 35. I'm not gonna talk to you because I don't want to risk a game over. If I get the wrong answer, I probably lose. You're charging your Magatsuhi, so I shouldn't even try to... I almost did that, and that would have sucked. Ama. I should, like, go back and save. <laughs> like, before I have to do that abscess again. So, I don't know where that side quest for the demon is, but we'll find it eventually, I'm sure. Let's just go back to the last ley line. Just so we could save our game. I really want to get Hua Po, so I might do that right now. Go grab uh, Hua Po. The best ley line to go is be the Bayashi. We'll find it eventually. Also, I will grab that vending machine while I'm in the area. We are pretty good on Maka, and I want to keep it that way. So we still have to go back. Oh, whoops. We still have to go back at some point to Minato and see if those demons require, like, if any of them are craving the relics we have to see what those rewards are. I do want to do that, though. I'm going to do that soon because I want to sell all my relics if none of them appeal to them. So I probably will do that today for sure. Tribute to Lightning, right? Yeah. I remember the Oni fight. Which quest? Oh, the only quest we have right now involves... What was his name again? I don't remember. It was the quest for Succubus. Succubus is the quest giver. I don't remember the demon's name. Komahanda, something like that. Light. You block light. Mm. I'm still gonna do this, honestly. You don't resist light. I won't lose turns. It's chip damage. I'll take it. Oh, you block ice, though. That's a big problem. And I could just burn you to death. Kumahanda, Kamhanda is not too difficult. You could probably do it right now. Who is Kamhanda, though? I don't even know who that is, honestly. Is it that weird raptor? Is it like the weird horse thing with the hat? We did see a horse thing with the hat level 34. Is that Kamhanda? Because if that is Kam Honda, we did encounter it. I didn't try fighting it. Because I, di I didn't want to, like, risk a game over. So I just ran from it. If that's Kam Honda, then I will try and fight it if it relates to a quest. That is Kam Honda. Alright, we passed it then. Perfect. We also, um... We also did beat Jatayu. 
Jatayu was level 25. We did take on Jatayu and beat it. So, uh, I did it just for the XP. Obviously, I should have done it earlier, but we did it. We got Jatayu down. All right, I want to get Huapo. Where is Huapo? I just want to register or try and negotiate with Huapo. But there's gear. That thing is way too strong. So is the Golem and so is the thing in um, Minato. The Dire Foes are a little too strong. They're like level 40 plus. So we should wait a little longer for those. There's Huapo. What's up? I think after we get Huapo, we'll probably go to the World of Shadows. I want to see what fusions we could do. We did the fight at level 30. Yeah, we, we'll probably try come Honda. I mean, we're right near it. I passed it. And you told me it's manageable. We'll go do that. I shouldn't have hit Huapo if I'm trying to negotiate with it. Hopefully it won't matter. I don't know if that's actually a statistic, by the way. I'm not sure if you hit the demon, it lowers your chances, but, um... Pass. Chat. Hey, can I rip off your arms and legs? No. Why, though? Because I'll die. You're so fragile for a demon. Oh, well. Well, Poe is like a playful type. I thought that would work. I guess not. Oh, dear. Jack Frost is weak to fire. But I blocked it, so it's fine. What will you do? What did I do last time? Sing? I'm gonna try dancing. Try dancing. You really are a good dancer. I kind of want to be your friend. Yo, let's go. I think I tried sing last time and it didn't work. What do I do? Take my money. Go ahead. I'm rich. Two ice shards? Take them. I'll buy more from Gustav. Take my HP, I'm going back to a ley line. Nailed it. Nice to meet you. Dry Huapo. Nice to meet you too. Alright. Not bad, not bad. Special fusion? Um, yeah. Is it Anahita? Because we could probably get Anahita. Anahita's a special fusion. I We're going to the World of Shadows right now, so we're going to see what's over there. I definitely want to register and see what demons we can get. Probably not change all of our team members, but maybe get some new ones. Welcome to the world of shadows. Yes, hi, Sophia. It is Anahita. She was available at 29. I think I remember that, actually. I forgot who she required me to fuse, but I think I uh, considered. You... Either way, I want to see if we can get some new demons. Probably keep some of the ones. Let's see the specials. Wow, there's a 33 one. Who is this? Oh, King Frost. Okay. Does this require Jack Frost? No, it doesn't. Oh, we would need whoever this is. This is Gembu. And Naga. We could get a Naga from negotiating. Plus, we're rich now, so, like, again, money is not a problem. We could buy back demons. Let's just see who we could do with regular fusion. Wait, I, I don't want to do it like that. I want to do a reverse compendium confusion. Let me see. Thoth, I remember Thoth. Ooh, Quesicoddle. Oh, Quesicoddle. I remember Quesicoddle. I would use a Huapo. There's Nekamata. What um demons do I need for you? I can either do Compatango and Mothman, which is probably what I'm going to do, honestly. But I'm not 34 yet. Black Ooze. Jatai oh, there's Jatayu. <laughs> we, we killed Jatayu. Now we can get one. There's Fornius. I remember Pisaka. Pisaka was the thing that helped me in Nocturne. It had all those um exploring skills. Let me get this little thing. Icorn and Kelpie. We could do High Pixie and Yeah, let's do this thing. Just to get it in the compendium. Even even if we're not gonna use it. This thing is adorable. Your light potential is solid. Healing skills are also solid. Give you two rune to plus four, yeah. This will just give you accuracy up. 
Is this demon to A lot's happening in chat. Look at the 53 one. The special fusion at 53. I'll do that. Should use Chiro. Look at his unique skills. I don't know which one Chiro is. We'll probably find it. I'm a little overwhelmed. I'm not sure what demons I'm using. Whatever demons look cool to me. <laughs> honestly. And if it's a demon I really like from Nocturne. Maybe. I mean. If it's a demon from Nocturne and I used it in my ideal team. The, the strat is probably not to use it. Because I used it in Nocturne. I want to use other demons. I mean, if, I'm, if, if Thor comes up, if Thor is in the game, I'm using Thor, though. That's the exception. I will use Thor at the very end if he's in the game. Other than that, though, I'll most likely be like, maybe I'll use it again if I use it in Nocturne. But other than that, probably not, unless it's Thor. Also, chat's talking about a DLC. Is there a DLC for this game? How much is that DLC? Because that's tempting. I'll buy DLC for this game. How much is DLC and is it worth it? Obviously, if I like the game, is it worth it? Is my question. I don't think I really care for Jatayu. Let's look at the special fusion that chat is telling me about. 53? Oh, this is a uh, Hydra? Yeah, this is Hydra. This is Alice. I don't know who this is. King Frost. Okay. What do I need for you? I, we need to get Gembu. How do I get Gembu? Because Anahita I might want to have on the fusion. Even if it's not something I'll use. I'll probably use Anahita though. Instead of Amino Uzume maybe. Let me go to the reverse compendium. And look for Gembu. Who's level 23. Here you are. I mean, this is the cheaper one. So let's do this. Gonna have to use a bit, um, a bit of money, but that's fine. Plus five ice is amazing. I mean, you already have ice breath. It's definitely worth it. It depends what else you learn. Let's give you Tarikaja. We can use Tarikaja. Uh, Secunda's fine. And we'll give, we'll just give you Mabufu. You're gonna get Bafula, which is really nice. What rock have you been under? I haven't looked at anything related to the game. I'm playing the game. I didn't want to look at spoilers. I avoided every single trailer. The only trailers I watched for this game were the first two. I have- I've only seen two trailers for this game. I avoided, like, every news the game was getting because I want to play the game myself and experience it. But apparently, apparently chat is telling me there's $10 DLC for the Fiends and Demi. Comes with all the Fiend fights from Nocturne and makes them usable. Also has an extra fight with Demi. That's tempting. I'll probably do that. I'll probably buy that DLC. $10 is really good, especially because the game is so good. This game is so good already, that's really tempting. Dragon Zoo, yeah, sure. I'm going to call you Gembu because I do not know how to pronounce that. $3 for an extra bonus boss against Cleopatra and Mephisto, also making them fusible. I'll definitely buy the $10 one. The other ones I'll think about, but honestly, with the way the game's going, I'll spend like... Almost 20 like $15 to $20 on DLC for this game. But yeah, I, I haven't looked at anything related to the game. Like, every every trailer you posted in Discord, I, I have not looked at. I don't watch them because I like to I like to experience things firsthand. I normally don't like to know things before, but I mean, the fact that I know there's DLC, that's, that's fine. I don't mind that I know that. I just don't want to know, like, deeply about the DLC. Like, I hate when game trailers give you too much, like, show you a lot of things about their game. That's why I just avoid trailers mostly. Unless it's like an announcement trailer. Like if the trailers. Like if, if the trailers. um, If the trailers are like, you know, if it's a, an announcement trailer, I'll watch it, obviously. But if it's a trailer like I know FF7 remake, the final trailer for that game, like spoiled. Apparently it spoiled like the whole game, which is why I'm glad I didn't watch it. 
That's why I just don't watch trailers if I know I'm gonna play the game. What? Oh, I love this thing. I can't get it. I'm 43. There's Anubis. Oh, what did I want to do with, um, what's his face? Oh, right. Uh, Anahita. Oh, do I need this one too? Alright, we're gonna go pick up a Naga, I think. Instead.